Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if this is your first time watching one of my videos. My name is Mary and I make budgeting videos along with budgeting and cash stuffing my paychecks. So today we are going to do an old one because I didn't have a chance to really have a final breakdown of one of our old paychecks. So this one is paycheck number two and it's from the beginning of the month, from the fourth actually. Um, by the time I was able to sit down and properly budget, it was the 13th. So that's why you're going to see I am budgeting for the week of the 13th until the 18th and the 18th, we will get paid again. Um, so this is what I am working with. We had already spent some money from before that. Um, so this is what is left and let's get right into it. So for rent, we have 1730 um, emergencies. So we had a, a medical emergency. Thank God everything is fine and we are over that. Um, but it was very unexpected and we had to come up with a cost because I don't have medical insurance, which is crazy because all the time that I did have medical insurance, we never really had anything serious, thank God, happen. And now that I don't have medical insurance, something crazy happened. So I couldn't even believe it. So we had to pay out of pocket a lot. Um, and it, it's been a rough beginning of the month, but all is good. And hopefully for July, we can get back at it because, um, that really sucked us dry this month. So hopefully July will be a better month. Um, so that was a thousand dollars. At least that was like partial payments, like unbelievable. Um, then our gas bill is 43 medical and this is just, um, medical is pretty much like what we pay for the pediatrician, um, when we need to go, um, take our kids. Um, and who was it? I think, yes, Winston, my little one had an ear infection, so we had to take him in. Um, but yeah, I do like to put money aside so that anytime they do go, we have the money there. We are waiting for um, the end of the year so that open enrollment starts at my husband's job and we can get back into medical insurance um, because yeah it's expensive when things happen and you're not covered um, FPL is 86 water I did not that was my elbow guys that was a weird sound <laughs> um, water is 166 um, car gas is 50 groceries 60 because it's a short week so it's only 60 and some passes 90 and then for our sinking funds um a hundred dollars towards our e-fund we have to start all over again with our emergency fund because we had to use it so a hundred dollars um father's day 160 christmas i'm so excited about um, Christmas is 120. So what we're going to do this time around, um, if you remember from last year, we did a goal of $2,000 for Christmas and it was great. Uh, we did the whole year of savings. We took out $50 from each paycheck and that gave us $2,000 by the time Christmas came around and it was awesome. This year we're starting mid year because of all the changes in our finances and stuff. We couldn't really get a head start, but Either way, beginning at mid-year at June still gives you a good solid six months. So if you haven't started saving for Christmas, it's not too late. Um, uh, so we're going to do that. We're just going to do a thousand um, this year and I'm going to take out around 60 per paycheck. Um, so I'm really excited to get that started. So it's 120 because this is from this paycheck and then my first paycheck from the month that I didn't really get to um, show you guys. So that's 120. Um, fun day is 100 and then birthday gifts because I have my nephew's birthday coming up is going to be 50 and that is how I'm going to allocate everything and now we are just going to subtract now there are three things that I had already taken out in cash so I did not um, I'm not going to count that when I subtract. So these three actually I already have in cash and that's what I'm going to stuff today. Everything else is online and stuff. So let's do our little math here. Okay. 
Okay, so that's gonna leave me with a total of 28.78. And I'm going to leave that there because I always like to leave a little bit of cushion or whatever is left over after I budget everything out. So now we are going to stuff our little pay chart, our little um, sinking funds, I mean. And it's gonna be easy because they are all 20s today. So first one, we have our emergency fund, and that is going to be $100. So two, four, six, eight, and 10. And then we have Father's Day. Two, four, six, eight, ten, and then two, four, six. And then Christmas is going to be one twenty, so two, four. Six, eight, ten, and then twenty. Good. All right. Very simple this time around. All right. So this is it for this paycheck. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for budgeting with me. And I will see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and notification bell. And that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.